ISP is um, Iraqi Serial Project. It's a program to help Iraqi students who can't study in college to continue their education in America. They support us and they help us uh, to learn college skills such as writing essays, uh, book reviews. My name is Tamara al Rai. I'm 21 years old and uh, I'm an Iraqi girl I'm from Baghdad. My name is Zaid Ahmed. I am from Baghdad, born and raised. Uh, I've spent 19 years there, moved to Damascus in February 2007. The field that I want to study most is communication, computer communications and networking. I want to major in education for elementary schools. Go to the forest and Ralph to the... What got me interested in ISP is the thought that I could actually move the clock because for me time stood still. I couldn't get a job, I couldn't finish my college education. So the concept of actually having that chance to go, to study, and America has some of the best colleges in the world. So to go and get top level education and be able to utilize that and come back is something I really admired. And I jumped at the opportunity. We have different teachers. They teach us a lot of things like writing academic essays. We're taking note-taking skills and we have critical analysis classes. Every week we're doing something new. Every Friday we have writer's workshop. It's write, 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 essays, 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 all kinds. Even poetry, we did sonnets, we did haikus. Every four sessions, that means two weeks, we have a new book, discussions, and it's great. Hopefully, I'll be able, with, I mean, with the help of everyone else, we'll probably be able to rebuild Iraq to its former glory. And this is probably the biggest dream I have. Teaching children is one of the best things that a person could do because you're gonna raise a new generation, especially in Iraq. Iraqi kids need to know a new values than, they, than the values that they have now. Now they only know discrimination, this is Sunni, this is Shia, and that's it. But maybe later in the future, when I get to teach them, when my generation get to teach them, we're gonna get to teach them that we're all human and we don't need to be separated as according to our sex or according to our gender or anything else.